Hey everybody, it's Joanne from Artsy Light Tarot. Thanks for checking out this message. I'm going to be doing a general check-in for the sign of Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. And I've been drawn to use the very OG tarot to start out the reading. So guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, please show me the energy that surrounds the Aquarius collective at this time. So releasing anxiety after dealing with someone that impacted your stability healing though very much the energy of healing show me the energy that surrounds aquarius at this time spirit thank you so releasing a soul connection releasing someone that you've put a lot of investment in trusting your intuition high priestess six of cups is scorpio energy you are trusting that it is time to release someone that you had been con had a soulmate connection with someone that you possibly had children with you are releasing them and trusting that is the divine that is what is divinely guiding you in that direction No longer making any, any foolish gestures towards this person trusting in the institution and in your own morals and values. No longer putting any investment into someone who is foolish, who's still holding on to you. Never expected you to walk away from them, honestly. Two of Cups in the reverse after releasing a soulmate connection. So definitely very much picking up. Just look at this. We've got the High Priestess in the upright and the Hierophant, which is a, an indication of spiritual guidance trusting in your moral compass in in your divine intuition you're definitely being divinely guided towards releasing a soul connection someone that was a soulmate someone that you had invested with for a long time someone that you possibly had children with and and who are very surprised that you actually release them because they have so much ego because they were foolish you're no longer investing in this person no longer having any expectation you've turned your back on this person so spirit is wanting you to know that at this time spirit please give me an oracle card to verify or clarify this energy please so in the reverse escape avoiding blocking pushing away hiding you're no longer hiding from the fact that this this was a horrible ending you're no longer hiding from the fact that this person needed to be released because you recognize that they are not your path and and they're no longer blocking you from your future right and you're not running from this anymore you recognize that it was in your path to release this person, even though that was very difficult for you to do so, Aquarius. I feel that. What other messages do you have for Aquarius at this time, Spirit? What else does Aquarius need to know? Thank you. So Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. The Knight represents Capricorn energy. So not making investment in this time page of pentacles represents good news so someone is experiencing judgment at this time someone is experiencing their karma in regards to a heart um, a connection of the heart where there is no forward momentum at this time. So spirit is acknowledging this person that you've released is experiencing their karma. Someone that you had invested love with, but are no longer doing that because of the deception, because this person deceived you, because this person played games, this person was manipulative. So spirit is showing that they are experiencing their judgment after you have released them, no longer hiding, um, you were never hiding. I just feel this person kept you in the dark. This person deceived you, five of swords, and impacted your ability to move forward for a long time, impacted your stability, took away a lot of opportunities for you because of their lies and deception and bullshit, right? Where you felt like you had to defend yourself. 
But there is good news. There is good energy now surrounding you now that you have released this person. You're no longer rushing into things, though. I feel that Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel that you're smart now. I feel that you possibly may have rushed into this person previously, this past person. You may have rushed into a commitment with them. And you are acknowledging the fact that you're no longer rushing into things because you do see your own value and worth at this time. Spirit, can you please give me some more energy? In regards to the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. Oh my goodness, there's a lot here. <laughs> okay, Spirit, let's see. So Knight of Pentacles in the reverse is now is being clarified with. So not making any rush movements towards um, this past person. Recognizing there was no investment because this person burdened you quite a bit. But you've learned your lessons Tens represent the end of a cycle and it's in the reverse. So you have ended the cycle, but you have also released the burdens of this cycle. So you're not even carrying the burdens of this person anymore. This person that puts you in an illusion. So 10 of wands is Sagittarius energy. And then we've got seven of cups, that Scorpio energy. This person had many options as well. This person that you've released, this person is no longer burdening you. They are not as they seem. You know this, but not everyone around them knows this, but that is coming to light. That is something that they work very hard to invest in is hiding, but that is something that is coming to light. I feel this person is experiencing their karma and they are starting to be seen for that, which they, um, for who they truly are. Page of cups. This person was very emotionally immature, right? This person offered you just enough to um, keep you in an illusion and but they were very much playing games and I feel that that came to light this was a very emotionally manipulative and immature person who played a lot of games because of their ego this is someone that is not emotionally mature and never will be and there is forward communication let me just try to fit all this in here there is communication coming forward. There is forward momentum towards you releasing heartbreak. Again, you have released this person. You're releasing this heartbreak. You have broken contract with this person. You have, you have divorced this person. There you are showing up Aquarius as wish fulfillment, showing in the upright, showing up as a, as a energy of balance, being divinely guided right? Pouring into all of the proper cups after releasing this person, beautiful energy, this person who you thought was going to be your 10 of cups, your forever after, but you are now standing and moving towards that, which is your destiny, being divinely guided, releasing this king of pentacles in the reverse. This person's phony. This person's broke. This person's experiencing their karma. You are releasing and walking away. Very clear message from spirit. Actually, let me, I'm going to put that back. I'm going to pull an oracle on this. Spirit, can you please clarify this person's energy tethered in the reverse? Yeah, you're releasing this person. You are very connected to this person. This is a very strong soulmate connection. This was definitely divinely guided. This was a karmic. This was meant to be. This was a soulmate. But you are no longer connecting to this person, right? The tether is cut. You may have done some soul cutting, um, from this person, magnifying glass, showing proof, validation, confirmation, finding the truth. You've released the need because you know this person puts you in a lot of deception and an illusion. Spirit, is there any more energy that you would like Aquarius to know in regards to this validation, this confirmation here, the clarification cards? Is there any more energy? So definitely uh, uh, disconnecting. You've done cord cutting on this person. You have cut the cords from this person. You are no longer communicating. You're not, you're not waiting for anything. You, you're not waiting for anything from this person. And then we've got signs in the reverse. Meanings, repeated numbers, synchronicities. Not needing any validation either after releasing pain excruciating pain this person really broke your heart Aquarius but you are releasing that you are walking away you have moved away from this person 
Okay, I'm going to get some new energy. I'm going to see what the future energy holds for you, Aquarius. But Spirit is definitely um, acknowledging the fact that you have divinely guided away from this person and that the best is yet to come for you. I feel that. So Guardian Angels, Archangels, Spirit Guides, please show me the future energy that surrounds the Aquarius Collective. Please show me the future energy for Aquarius. Thank you, Spirit. Five of Cups, releasing heartbreak. No longer, no longer sitting with the Three of Cups and the spilled out cups, recognizing that there's two cups behind you, recognizing that your true soulmate is just around the corner. And that is your future energy, right? Releasing this person that impacted your finances, this immature, again, showing up. This person's lacked any type of maturity in regards to emotions have impacted your legacy made you feel impacted your finance right so guardian angels archangel spirit guys please give me more future energy for aquarius thank you yeah you're moving towards calmer waters so five of cups is scorpio energy and then we've got six of swords there you are moving away from heartbreak moving away from the spilled emotions and devastation that this past person caused you moving now towards calmer waters, moving towards your soulmate, right? Judgment is coming and judgment does not need to be this harsh karma. Karma can be just that moving on with your life, recognizing that it's okay that you, that you still at times grieve, but you are moving forward. You are releasing, you are growing, you are ascending, Making a choice to move forward after heartbreak, right? So you are moving towards calmer waters. Is there any more queen of wands in the reverse? Not afraid to be passionate. Not afraid to show your passion and emotion. Queen of wands is Leo energy, right? Or moving away from someone that was very vain. Someone that operated just on um, ego. You're, you're moving away from that. You're not interested in that anymore. You're not interested in, in someone that is empty. You want everything. You want your full meal deal. You're not interested in, some, in a, a nice package. You want someone that has substance, not a page of cups. You want your king of cups. Spirit, what will the outcome be? Yeah. No longer investing in this person, releasing your heartbreak. I'm going to ask Spirit now. Spirit, can you please show me the future energy for Aquarius foresight so all there's something coming there is foresight trust your intuition in regards to a fork in the road something is coming in your future a few days to weeks few months keep plugging forward make forward motion okay yeah you're you're not afraid to face reality you've done nothing wrong you you're confident that your karma is good so Aquarius, if this resonated with you, please let me know. Uh, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much if you got to the end of this video. I really appreciate it. If you're interested in a personal reading, hit me up. Take care, Aquarius. Bye.